Holy crap, guys, it is Friday the 13th, and I could not resist coming back one more time to the Spirit Halloween in New Jersey so that we could see all the Friday the 13th stuff they have. Okay, guys, here we go. We are gonna scour this place and find everything that has to do with Friday the 13th. I am pretty sure they have a Friday the 13th shirt. Okay, okay, yeah, here we go. I wish it was Friday. Well, you're in luck, Jason. And look, they have four of them in stock right here, guys, if you want to get down here and get them. And look how quickly even just the t-shirts are selling out, guys. I don't get why the other spirits are not open yet. They are leaving a lot of money on the table. But anyways, okay, that looks like it's the only Friday the 13th shirt they have. So let's move on down this way. Friday the 13th, Jason Voorhees, where are you? Okay, I don't see anything in this aisle here or that one. I don't see anything in this aisle. We're right there. Uh, here or here. Wait, let me just look right up here. There's Pennywise. Uh, a little bit of Hocus Pocus going on here. We got Chucky here and we got Friday the 13th, guys. Holy crap. This is just the beginning. Wait, let's start over here with just the basic hockey mask. And if you want this, it's $6.99, and you could customize this to make it look like a sweet old beat-up Jason mask. Down here, they even have just the basic machete. Let's see how much this is here. $12.99 for the basic machete. So for 20 bucks, you could have yourself a Jason costume. I actually might just have to get one of these myself to customize it just because that sounds like such a fun thing to do. We've got the Friday the 13th Socks Camp Crystal Lake Counselor. Ooh, and this is a little bit different back here, Camp Crystal Lake. Then we've got these awesome ones that I love so much with Jason's face right on them. And look, oh, Jason lives. I love these socks. I really want to get these. <laughs> I could just go nuts getting stuff in here, guys. And then we have one more style of the Jason socks, embroidered Jason mask right there. Uh, what does it say out here? It's Friday the 13th, okay. We've got a Camp Crystal Lake ball cap. Friday the 13th, what is this, like a, a oh, this is a choker, this is like a necklace. Okay, a little Jason mask on there, and the F-13 tag. Then we've got the Jason hockey mask jersey right here. That is for a girl, actually. You can tell by the way that's uh, got the woven thing up here. That's pretty cool. And then you've got these right here, which is just like a basic uh, hockey jersey. Voorhees on the back, number 13. This is pretty cool. I love this mask on there. Jason Voorhees woven work shirt. So here's part of the costume. Again, Camp Crystal Lake. And it says J Voorhees. <laughs> That's too funny. That's adult size. It's just the shirt. Ooh, we got a Friday the 13th beanie. This is pretty cool. That's embroidered on there. That's pretty nice. I like the mask on there. Then we've got a prop replica mask here. This one looks really cool. And this is apparently a replica mask from part three. Made by NECA. That is a pretty good looking mask right there. I like that. And that's $39.99 for anybody who's wondering. I always forget to tell the prices of this stuff because I get so excited while I'm looking at it. We got the mask and machete dual pack. That's $24.99. That's a pretty good looking mask there too. It's not like one of those cheap ones that's just going to break real easy. And the machete has got a black blade with blood on it. That's a pretty cool set right there. Oh, look at this. We got the Jason Voorhees dress up here. This is a pretty cool looking outfit for a girl. Look, she's got the mask and the blade and then the Camp Crystal Lake hockey jersey. I like that. This is just the jersey here. Well, okay, they call it a dress because I guess it's a one piece, but uh, that is pretty cool. Okay, it looks like that's it for this section at least. Let's keep looking around though because I think they have more. Okay, so we're going to look in this section here for anything Jason Voorhees, which, um, well, here's a machete. It's just like a basic machete right there if you're just looking to put together a costume. And that is $14.99 just for the regular machete. Okay, and looking over here, let's see. We do have a couple of different masks. Uh, they're glow in the dark. These two look a little bit different. Um, 
well, I guess the only thing different about them is that this one here is kind of shiny and this one is dull, but they both glow in the dark. So that's pretty cool. Glow in the dark Jason mask. And let's see if there are any other Friday the 13th masks over here in these. I don't see any at the moment, but somebody did tell me that there is a, a new Halloween Michael Myers mask coming out for Halloween Kills. Um, apparently it was out here the first day when they opened and it wasn't supposed to be, so they put them back behind the scenes. If I remember correctly, there was some Friday the 13th stuff over here the other day. Uh, let's just take a look. I know in other stores, other years, they have had the Jason Pathway markers, but I don't see them at least on this side of the aisle. Um, okay, yeah, I don't see anything over here either. Hello, zombie babies. Oh, somebody bought the burrito, baby. I don't see any Jasons in this aisle either, but let's keep looking because I'm sure they have more. Okay, let's head over this way. This is the kids' costumes. Um, okay, here we go. We got a little bit of stuff over here. Here's just basic machete. It's smaller than the other ones, though, for a kid. Here's that hockey mask again. And that kind of looks like that might be it. At least, I mean, for the kids section here. So let's keep looking around here. All right, yeah, I don't see any in kids, but up here in the front, there's always things like these little tins, candy tins, and here's a Chucky tin. So I'm sure we're gonna find some more things up here that has to do with Friday the 13th or Jason. Here's our Hocus Pocus. Okay, let's see. I know they have mugs over here somewhere. Where in the heck did I see those things? The store is so huge, I don't know where anything's at. Oh, here it is, okay. Yeah, I see some other stuff over here. Um, let's just keep looking. Okay, this is all Michael Myers stuff here. Well, not all of it, but look, they have Michael Myers string lights. And I do remember seeing Jason's string lights, but I don't know if I saw them here. Oh, here's a Friday the 13th towel. A tea towel. Who's having tea with Jason Voorhees? Here we go. Here's a Jason mug with a little mask. And he spins. It's a spinning Jason mask. All right, let's see. Is there anything over here? Friday the 13th. There's Jason with his machete. I love the spinning Jason mask. Look at that. That is too funny. Oh, and here's a little different mug down here. I actually have this one, or at least I did have it before I moved into the RV, but it just takes up so much room. But look, the machete for the handle and the mask is the mug. <laughs> That's pretty cool. Let's see, do they have any throw blankets for Friday the 13th? I don't see any. Oh yeah, here we go. I wish it was Friday. It's just like the shirt. You could get the shirt and this and have a movie night. That would be sweet. All right, let's go up here and look at all this little stuff up here. They have stickers and magnets and all kinds of stuff. So I bet they have some Friday the 13th stuff. All right, they have all kinds of lanyards here. Um, Hocus Pocus, Nightmare Before Christmas. Here we go, right on the end, Friday the 13th lanyard. There he is, Jason. Holy crap, guys, look at this. Halloween-y nails, press-on nails. I'm totally getting some of these for Marion. <laughs> <laughs> okay, here we go. We got Friday the 13th playing cards, and we have a Camp Crystal Lake keychain key fob. That's pretty cool. Look at this. We even got a magnetic notepad that says, Welcome to Camp Crystal Lake, Friday the 13th. I bet Jason keeps his kill list on here. Okay, we got spirit buttons here. I see Freddy. I see another Freddy, Beetlejuice. Uh, let's see. Oh, there he is. Jason Voorhees Friday the 13th button. Oh, look at this. We got a couple of uh, Friday the 13th cups here. Here's a tumbler. Welcome to Camp Crystal Lake. We got a Jason uh, tumbler back here. This one is pretty awesome, actually. Looks like we have another one back here. Let's see what this looks like. Another tumbler. Okay, got Jason's mask on there. Look, we also have a Jason mini snow globe. Let's make it snow. Let's make it rain on Jason. <laughs> All right, guys, that brings us to the end. And I see, I think, our very last Jason thing right here. This mug, Friday the 13th mug. Let's take a look at it here. Yep, 
Friday the 13th, that's a huge mug too. That would be sweet for sitting around fires, carving pumpkins, having hot chocolate after trick-or-treating. And that appears to be it, guys, but I have to point this out because this is one of the coolest mugs I've ever seen in my life. Back to the Future 2. How cool is that? Look, we got the hoverboard for the handle. Wait, I almost missed it. Friday the 13th, Jason Tins, Sour Cherry Candy Cleavers. How cool is that? Apparently the candy is shaped like cleavers. I totally have to buy this just because I have to see it for myself. All right, guys, that was it. One last walk through the Spirit Halloween here in New Jersey. I'm so stoked to see all the Friday the 13th stuff. I bought a handful of things right here, and uh, you guys will see those later. Make sure you subscribe and watch the videos. More coming.